Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Rain Slick Pursuit of Darkness, episode 1! Da, 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 da. We are... Actually, yes, we are on our way to the vendor, because, like I promised, I got ourselves enough coins, uh, tokens, to get the horn. The ornamental horn, I want to buy it, let me take it off your hand. Give it. Give me the goddamn tokens. For you can even get all the coins and the country credits has begun to feast. You draw back your hand in fear and alarm. Gabriel snatches the horn and leaps back to safety. This disused funnel smells strongly of liquor. I think it's time to leave. Intimidated by my selection, are you? It's understandable. Your selection is over. You've got nothing more to give. But we, on the other hand, have the spell that will dispel the spell that is preventing us from entering us. Uh, sorry. Uh, the, is preventing us from entering um, the last part of the boardwalk. Of the Pelican Bay Boardwalk. And hopefully, it harbors not only this weird flying mime thingy that has the last piece of our mime quest but also the last two or to be more precise the last four um, robots for the last 100 parts the cataract waits it waits in lessons read the words of the last fortune guys i think i've got it you hold the fortune up and pretend to speak the words into the oh prepare to speak the words into the waiting horn as you begin, you become aware that no sound is passing your lips. Even halfway through the phrases, the mute words rasp your tongue, unfolding their bleak eternities in your gibbering mouth. You try to stop, but the words strive against you with their own vile momentum. As if in answer, the gate swings wide. It doesn't swing wide, that just no more weird gray funnel thingies no he's the winner why look I'm not actually concerned about any of this the fence down doesn't matter uh oh pretend I have a grenade oh snap that's not good Allowed to do something else. Uh, where are my attacks? Jesus. I mean, come on. Give me a break. Ah, uh, we're pretty weak. And I have a bow and arrow? Cut you What the hell? Uh oh. Ah, oh, man. This is not gonna end well. We need to get rid of the weak sauce. Pretend I have a lasso. Well, pretend that what? At least partially. Then I have a grenade. Come on. Give me some attack! Can I have a lasso? Yes! Yes! You're gonna end! I mean die! You're gonna die now! It's gonna end for you! I don't even know what to say! I'll have to up, But not for long! I will end you completely! Well, the flame will probably won't play. probably won't end completely. But what I'm gonna do to you shall. No, don't pretend I'm a grenade. Ah oh, man. Suddenly our attacks are puny. Puny attacks. Oh, 
any attacks of Well, you know what? Have some of your own um, medicine. Strike with all your force. Which is actually not. And Gabriel level up. Uh, so what is it supposed to give me? Oh yeah, that's definitely something there. Oh shit! Four. I'm certainly gonna screw around with those attacks. Um, I'm gonna try my best to just survive this. Because four is a lot. I don't think I'll be able to handle four as easily as I can. I think two. As easily as I think two. Why am I attacking the one I wanted? I don't know. Do you know? No. Nobody knows why I can't seem to think straight whenever things like those happen. Well, anyway, how about I weaken you all? And he's just gonna do a bit of grooming. Uh, which sadly didn't do much. Damage. Damage. Oh no! Oh, she's incredibly weak. So... Oh, come on. I should be able to do 3 damage. Yes! 3 is all I'm asking for. I'd like to kill some of those specialists. Especially since... Uh, I'm almost full on. Died. Died of dysentery. Oh, he did die of dysentery. Oh, he died of dysentery in this game. But he could have. Um, 124? Do you think I'll be able to do that? I don't think so. Ready, set, go! Bing, bing, bing. And yes, it was enough. Ooh, count for that. Not that it. Except if I use this, which I think they're weak against. So this might kill him instantly. Yes, it does. Fine. Okay. And I've got my ten. Times overkill damage bonus thing. Anyone's haven't, but ah, oh, what the hell? All fruit fuckers dead! Congratulations, you found and destroyed all robots in episode one. Uh, I sort of need the invisible rope, uh, but I don't want to go too far without my cool power up. I'm gonna help myself just yet. No. Why well, actually not just yet? Yes, just yet. Exactly just yet. Exactly yet. Ah! Confuse myself sometimes. Come on. And clear! Work continues apace! I will leave forever! Yes, I know. I have enough for an upgrade! I think it may be time to upgrade my rig again. While you were away, I researched the battle rigs that were used by the Gardener. What? Gardener? The who? The Gardener were a race of potent agrimancers. <laughs> oh, that's what he said. The Gardener were a race of potent agrimancers. I'm surprised you would turn to them for inspiration. Ordinarily, I wouldn't. I had little choice. I feel of free combat is especially broad. What the hell? <laughs> Rakist! Using a combination of science and painstaking research, and Claire has created an optimal rake! Congratulations, you've upgraded all of your weapons to maximum power! Two arms! Good luck. Meaning... Oh, sorry. That's not what I wanted to do! 
Meaning, case-wise, we've got keep searching for a new place to live, look for more clues, Pelican Bay. Finished, 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 sorry. Finished, finished. Almost finished. Solve the fortune riddlers, you will seize the light thingy. And the invisible... Um, uh, come on. The invisible robe. No, not the invisible. The invisible rope? No, I think I'm lacking the invisible stairs. The invisible stairs. I wonder what he what he will give. Whoa, his rake looks really menacing, and it doesn't look like something you can actually use to rake anything ever again in the world of ever. But I'm fine with it because I'm using it. As a weapon! It's not like he could, I don't know, just say, okay, well, rake was the only thing I had, but now, since we've passed, I don't know how many shops, I could just take a chainsaw? Oh, hell. A baseball bat? Just a knife? Something more than this? That is a disturbing statue, which looks a little bit like Cthulhu. Giant light, giant robot clue. This sparkling module is still functioning, just barely. We're leaving. We're taking this new thing back to Anclair now. I think we just joined the so-called big leagues. What? The new toy seems to be attracting a lot of attention. We're not leaving? Not just yet. Oh, also... Uh, um... What was that? Okay, we're actually not allowed to go any closer. I guess it's time to go home. Hold. His power is great, but I don't believe he has poured himself entirely into that vessel. He's still vulnerable. We must return to... Oh well, here with weapons. I know, I know, I know. And then in that moment of mortal fear, we will strike. Apparently, you screwed up. The riddle was, you will make the light yours? I mean, I just got a light. Ooh, maybe as a reward, I'll, I'll get the last invisible thing. Maybe, just me. What? Oh, snap. I really didn't think I'd have to fight anymore here. What? Uh oh. Snap, this thing really is the first thing I to do. Attack down. Attack down. I'll pass the book as always in the block. And even if I can use my normal attacks, I got, still got explosives. They'll do the job just fine. No. 320, 320. And another solution of putting the hurt on. Pretend you have a grenade. Oh, I blocked it! Nice. Still not doing a lot of damage though. Such a menace that I'm 
definitely gonna trap you. Shit, I could use that on the other uh, thingies, guys. He's trapped in a box. And now, his peril ends. Rather bloody. Yeah, no overkill. I know. Ooh. I maxed him out. <gasps> ah, there's the invisible briefcase. You think? I think so too. Which means this isn't the last thing. Which means. Uh, prophecy-wise? Oh, this thing is gone. Is the background here? How does that make any sense? Trap a mime! What? No effect? That's not cool. I'm sick of you! Let's just throw this all out. Level awesome. Oh, what? I thought I already had that. The hell? Well, you said I'll make the light mine, and I made the light mine. Your light were as a new slip to is depends from it. Oh boy, free fortune! Gabriel tucks it into the bones, prophecy, his knuckles growing whiter as he reads it. It promptly vanishes in a burst of flame. Oh yeah, fucker! You want to say that to my face? Another fortune is produced. Gabriel tears it out. This one too is consumed upon reading. Oh, that's... That's fucking it. <laughs> what the hell? What kind of fortune was that? <laughs> Goddamn smart ass. Did you see the one coming? Did you see that one coming, huh? Fucking fortune teller, motherfucker. By the four, you moron. That was a goddamn antique. It's like I can't take you to a terrifying carnival without you destroying a fortune telling machine. Probably a good thing we got the fortunes out of her first. I didn't get anything for that. You're kidding me, right? Oh, something glinters. Oh, something glints there nestled in the ruins. Scientists sometimes use this. What the upgrading? I kind of fail to see what? How? Do we have to talk to Aunt Claire? This is kind of kicking my ass. I don't really understand most of these things, but fine. Okay, I guess. Hello again. Oh, hello. Uh, I think we'll track down your ethereal equipment. This mime runs his hand along the nothing, which apparently 
with apparent satisfaction. It's all here! You know what? I've got something for you guys. He turns back for a moment, reaching into a large trunk for something that is apparently very heavy. Listen, I know you've been checking me out. It's alright. I look like a million fucking dollars. I haven't been. I don't know what you guys, but... I have a six-pack front and back. That's horrifying. I'll tell you my secret. It's an unbeatable mime regime called Exercise that uses spectral weights. Here, get a grip on this thing. It is indeed the heaviest void you've ever experienced. And after only a few illusory reps, you begin to feel... Or reaps? Reps. You begin to feel the burn. Combat upgrade. You feel strong and will stand to the player's attack. Hi. So, time to venture to one player's room. That's it for this episode. I have a strong feeling that the last episode is going to be the next episode. Which is... I mean to say the other way around. The next episode is going to be the last episode. Thanks for watching. Please comment and subscribe. Bye.